Borderlands Game of the Year Edition, aka Internet Explorer. But um, yeah, this just got announced like a week ago, and it's already out. Thirty bucks. Everything's remastered. Pretty. Uh, has all the DLC. Uh, yeah, it's like 4K, Ultra HD, HDR, all that jazz. They did quality of life stuff, like, uh, not only is there a compass, but now there's a minimap. Luckily. Little things, like, uh, I heard that you don't have to pick up money, health, and ammo anymore, it just gets sucked into you. Uh, they apparently redid the final boss, because everybody complained for the past 10 years that it was boring. So they apparently, like, redid it. And the first thing we're gonna do is they updated the original 10-year-old game on the 360. And they let you upload your character. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my level 67 Lilith, load her up, and just see if achievements pop. Because word on the street is that some... Yep. 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 And now they own my soul. And now I can oh, go everywhere. Import character. Uh, okay. I have a character. Check character will be saved as a new character? So now if I start game... I could do... Okay, so... So I click to... Network options, invite only. Cool. Um, does anybody know? No. Does anybody know if you could have more than one of a character? Like, can I have two Liliths? Because I want to play as Lilith again, but I don't want to lose my level 67. Let's just do this, just to see if the achievements pop, and then we'll start a fresh, uh... A fresh run. Found all six Claptrap stats. Yeah, so apparently... The zombie and Claptrap DLC shit pops. Which is so cool, because I fucking hate those DLCs, especially the achievements. The DLCs made me were like, okay, but the achievements sucked ass. Wait, was that it? Was that it? I thought more was gonna pop. Oh no, wait, they're not popping on screen, but I see them popping on my PC. Oh, can I? Oh, and you can skip that now? Dude, best game. Best game confirmed. Um, game options. Oh my god, that's a lot of stuff. Yeah, they added a mini-map, they redid the final boss, etc. Um... Controller, invert look on, there we go. You are late. We must speak immediately. So let's see I'm if... I'm afraid for my own security. And oh yeah, it is kind of... Wait, but it doesn't, like, always suck up? Talk to the mechanic. Th he to be fair, I think mind. that two and, and all that did the Don't same. Earned a million bucks? Dude, again. nice, nice, nice. Sure, accept. Sweet. I didn't even get the things to pop on screen. You could look at your achievement thing on the home. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. So, we've got... Final six claptrap statues, found 25 oil cans, collected 15 claptrap bobbleheads, collected 5 3D glasses, 3 panties, 5 fish in a bag, and 15 pizzas, and earned a million bucks. So I got all the claptrap stuff? You said that fast traveling to the Dr. Ned place popped those achievements, right? Or Dr. Zed or whatever? Do not take up arms to fight the oppressors. Is it this? You Jacob's Cove? I think so. Let's try it. Anyone here played Where the Bees Make Honey? No. I saw that there's um a guide and all that. I saw you completed it. I have the game, but I'll do that on a weekend or something off camera. And that's really funny, Kali, the idea of you dying a lot in Enter the Gungeon, level 1. It's possibly the worst game I've ever played. Yikes, that's saying a lot. You've played a lot of shit. How's the audio, by the way? Is the game too loud, or are we good? Before I actually like start for realsies. I always died a lot on Enter the Gunshin. Same. Nah, it's not popping. Alright, well, we'll exit for now. And we'll start a new playthrough. We'll start a new Lilith. Also, MN Games, how's it going? Um, so start game. Confirmed you can have two of the same character. Sweet. So I'm gonna do um, a new character. 
Okay. Play game. I'm getting things to pop by fast traveling. Sweet, I'll do that off camera then. I just wanted to show on stream that stuff does pop. So, you want to hear a story, huh? One about treasure hunters. <laughs> Have I got a story for you? Pandora. This is our home, but make no mistake. This is not a planet of peace and love. They say it's a wasteland, that it's dangerous, that only a fool would search for something of value here. Then perhaps I am a fool. But do not be fooled by what Pandora appears to be. There was a legend. Many people tell it. The legend of the vault. My father would always go on about the vault, even with his dying breath. Advanced alien <clears throat> technology. Infinite wealth. Fame, power, women. So you can understand why some little kiddos who hear the stories grow up to become vault hunters. Well, I have a story you may not believe, but I tell you it is true. The legend of the vault is real, and it is here on Pandora. And they, uh, yeah, let's call her a guardian angel, appear to guide the vault hunters to their prize. The tale begins right here, on Pandora, with the brave Vault Hunters, the Guardian Angel, and most importantly, me. Marcus. I bought this game for some reason, because it's awesome. So, for those that don't know, um, who weren't here, like about two years ago I streamed all the games. Um, Borderlands, I had played Borderlands 2 ages ago, it's one of my favorite games ever, but I had never played Borderlands 1. So yeah, two years ago I played Borderlands 1 for the first time, got all the achievements. I replayed Borderlands 2 into 360, got all the achievements, played on the 1 at the same time, got all the achievements. Played the pre-sequel on the 1, got all the achievements. The only one I'm missing is the pre-sequel on the 360, because I'm supposed to do that with, um, Ray, aka Brown Man. So I, like, kept it aside. But I think at some point, if, if we don't get around to it, I'm just going to do it alone. Because I want the completion. This is one of the things I was wondering, is... If these cutscenes were going to be redone, because on the Handsome Collection... They look fantastic. But the cutscenes were like the 360 versions. They look like shit compared to the gameplay. I'm assuming it's the same on PlayStation. It's probably like on the PS4 it looks great, but it has PS3 graphics. I don't know. And that too, I'm assuming... I'm assuming that this is going to have a free weekend, because I was searching for the Handsome Collection to see the price. Because I want to get it up, uh, get it again, just to help Ray with some stuff. But I'm not buying it for 70 bucks when I've already played it and I'm not going to actually, like, really play it. So I was going to, like, wishlist it and I saw that there was an option to install. Apparently... Um... Apparently people are saying that they tried to like boot it up and it said that they didn't own it So people are thinking that the handsome collection is gonna have a free weekend It's just that you could pre-install it now. So if that's something that interests you uh, Get on that Firestone Depot. Time to gather up your stuff <laughs> Who's getting off the bus? You with the sniper rifle and the crazy man I'm back I need you to stay calm and don't let on that anyone is talking to you. Start making your way off the bus. You don't have any reason to trust me, but I need you to believe that I'm here to guide you. I'm here to help you find the vault. In a moment, you'll be greeted by a funny little robot. Do everything he says. You'll know what I mean when it happens. I'll contact you again soon. Also, we're choosing Lilith because she's my wife. And don't you ever forget it. I forgot your stream chat was a level in here, Trash well, Cove. We're here. Don't worry about saying goodbye. I'm sure we'll be doing this all again soon enough. I feel like his voice is echoey. <laughs> Get off my bus. Weird. Uh, Eternal with the 21 months and Moe with the 21 months. Thank you very much, peoples. I appreciate it. Welcome back. And uh, once again, we have a new sub emote. The Shizbeal Creep emote. 
Clap tray. What up, dog? Long time no see, fuckface. I am CL4PTP. You may call me by my locally designated name, Claptrap. Before continuing, please accept this echo communication device and heads up display, provided free of charge by the Doll Corporation. So yeah, apparently there's a minimap for Borderlands 2, which is awesome, because we all know that my sense of direction doesn't exist. So that's cool. And I guess I'm supposed to have all kinds of goodies for playing uh, the other games. I think apparently you get like 75 gold keys. Which is fucking Great. insane. I insanity. Echo device is fully functioning. I wanted to say insane and insanity. I said insane. Because I am uh, what's known as a fucking idiot. My dudes. Alright, let me just see something right here. So yeah, you guys said that the... Um... Oh, there's a field of view slider? Let's go like 100. And see what... Uh, what that what what that is like jesus christ already starting huh um yeah okay we'll do that I'm big. hmm i really like that you have a uh, feel the view slider and shit yeah okay so you have the mini map from borderlands 2 oh beautiful beautiful 2d with the 16 months and he says no message dude what i got thank you man All right. Oh, you can change the name. Uh, she is gonna be. She is gonna be thicklit. Change head. Oh, dude. Nice ballin'. Oh, I kind of like the angsty, the like beanie. Or the cap or whatever. It will. Oh, hello. Oh hell yeah, hell yeah. I can make her all like twitch colors and shit. Ah. Um. Which I don't know which. There's not like a proper like purple or anything. Whatever. And then that'll be white. All right, cool. Uh, confirm an exit, dude. Hell yeah. Already starting off look like a ball. Isn't there a chest on top of one of these roofs? Uh, I thought that like the, or is it the bus station you get dropped? Or was that Borderlands Two? No, there's a chest up here, right? Oh, is it there? Yeah, it is. Let me see. Uh, it's orange is like the best tier, right? Like, is is that good stuff because of it's being the game of the year edition and I own the stuff? I don't remember. I have deja vu. I feel like we've seen this before. Yeah, two years ago already. I think it's just, it's just this one that I gotta jump on. Hold up, claptrap. I got business to attend to, buddy. What's up, light speed? Uh. I thought it was all supposed to like suck into you. I was lied to. Damn you, Twitter. Okay. Neat. I bonked my head on the ceiling. Oh. Cool. Yeah, this looks really cleaned up so far. Also, um, on PS4 and Xbox and all that, um, the Handsome Collection got free visual upgrades as well. Basically, like an Xbox One X upgrade and all that, like 4K Ultra HD, all that good stuff. For anybody who cares. Which weapon using Y? Hold the X button when picking up ammo to collect all ammo at once. Right. Right, right, right. Um. Alright. Let's do what we were supposed to do. Where did Claptrap go? Uh oh. There he is. Hey man, what's up? I'm over here! Yeah, I see you. You're up to 14 unlocks? Like achievements? What's up, boys? Okay. Hey, man. What up? Up to 14 unlocks. Damn. Just from fast traveling? I'm gonna have to do that. Get all the achievements. What the fuck am I supposed to do again? 
Hey, I don't have to like open this, go kill them? No? Oh. These weapons are so shit, dude. Oh wait, is this what? Oh, that's what's equipped. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm an idiot. Okay, we'll do that, and then this, and this. Hell yeah, that's a lot better. Still fast traveling so far. It's giving me quite a few. I'm hoping hitting level 43 will pop others. It should. That's my problem, is that uh, I'm level 68. I think the cap is 69. Or sorry, I'm 67. So to hit 68 is going to be a crazy grind. That being said, it's going to be faster than hitting level 50 again. And I'll be able to do only one playthrough, in theory. So, um... Chris, Chris DM'd me like a place that should work. Because apparently they scale to your level. Or I was thinking of going to Terramorphous. Uh, Cromorax and see if I, if I could just level up once and then I get I don't I don't remember how they go I think it's 5 10 25 50 so I should be able to pop all of those but yeah the thing the thing about this game I mean I can't confirm because it just came out but um I remember the handsome collection the way it worked is some stuff like leveling and all challenges and stuff like that it needed to be ticked what I mean by that is, uh, if you were level 50, it didn't pop the achievement, you needed to hit 51. So it was annoying for like all challenges, because if you did all the challenges, you couldn't retroactively pop it. Because you had no plus one available. In that case, you had to do everything from scratch. I was lucky, lucky that uh, a lot of that stuff, I was missing a few things. Also, what I was doing was like I was playing the 360 and the 1 version at the same time and like I hadn't done the DLC, let's say, in Borderlands 2. So what I would do is I would do 9 out of 10 missions, let's say. Then I would upload my character. I would go on the 1. I would do the last mission, get the achievement for doing all the missions, go back to the 360, do the last mission, and get the achievement for doing all the missions. And I did, you know, 11 instead of 20 missions. And I only did... I only had to repeat one thing instead of everything, which was nice. Too bad I don't have my 360 anymore. I had a modded weapon in this game. Fuck. Yeah, if your save was on the cloud, I doubt it back then. But if it was on the cloud, you could theoretically... Let's try this. Jesus Christ. Uh, you could theoretically download the 360 game, upload your character, and then download them in this. You just level up, leveling up permanently increases the amount of health you have and the amount of damage you deal also immediately gives you full health and shields. Hell yeah. I think you get skill points at level 5. God, this gun is just decimating them. Would be nice to one hit kill everything. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, I'm gonna worry about the the crazy stuff with with my super OP character. Again, shit like Cromorax and like harder or grindier stuff. Like I'm gonna do whatever I can with her to just save a lot of time because obviously these completions are very time consuming. And uh, you know, in two days, uh, Enter the Gungeon gets its last update, which is also gonna be a huge time sink most likely. So anything I could do to shave off time, obviously I'll do it, right? Plus, like, I've done it before. I mostly just want to replay the campaign on stream. Because it's dope. But if I could complete this in 30 hours instead of, like, 80. Uh, sure. Uh, sure, let's use a golden key. Why not? We have, like, 7 million. Right? How does it, Where does it show? Um... Does it not show where my golden keys are? Am I blind? Am I blind? It took them this long to add mini map. Well, I mean, it was over. Um, it wasn't never in this game. It was in two. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so those are all the challenges. 
That, okay. Hover over the chest. Wait, I don't see any number. Oh, there it is. I'm an idiot. I'm blind. It's right there. 74. So I was right. I don't know why. I just felt very uh, Attention, citizen of Firestone. out of the way. Okay. I was like looking in the middle of the screen because I'm an idiot. But sweet. They give you 75. Come on. But I'll, I'll save them. There's no use spending them at this point in the game. It's just a waste, especially when I've got two really OP uh, guns for where I am at, the, uh, where I'm at in the game. From fast traveling, you've got 17 out of 80 achievements to pop. Holy fuck! I guess I would have to load up playthrough one, but I'll do that after the stream. I'll just load. Up, I'll just fast travel from place to place. That's awesome. Snorlands, fuck off. Uh, diamond on your, uh, the waypoint, waypoint, okay. Waypoint is where you gotta go. Beep, boop, beep. Oh yeah, okay, so they completely redid the cutscenes for sure. Awesome. This looks amazing. Also, if you guys didn't see, Borderlands 3 is September 13th. So guess who's buying it as a birthday present to myself. Thanks for opening her up again. The name's Zed. Hi, Zed. My name's Zed, and I like to give head. From the vendors, you can buy all the healing you could ever want from a real doc. Thankfully, without the vault as a myth, you'll get yourself killed lecture. <laughs> so no head? <laughs> wow. I keep the medical. Sure. Peace, brother. What I like about this game... Or one of the things I like about the Borderlands games is that you could just fuck off and then they'll just like speak to you basically like via headset. You don't just have to stand around and listen to them, you could just run and carry on. If you're an impatient douchebag like myself, uh What? Oh, I missed the God damn it, claptrap. Yeah, I didn't watch the Joker trailer, I don't want to. Because trailers tend to just spoil everything nowadays. But I don't know. Maybe I will. I have high hopes for that movie. Joaquin Phoenix is, uh, the shit. Forgot that everybody blends in with the walls because, uh, yeah, it's the, the wonderful time when everything was just brown and gray. God, they're just getting blown to bits. Hey, buddy. That little robot is hurt. He isn't going to last very long without attention. This is so crisp and brown. <laughs> but yeah, it definitely looks really crisp. And um, I didn't notice any visual stuff, though. Like, it, it gives you the brightness and field of view, but it doesn't give you, like, um... You know, if you want performance or visual or anything like that, maybe it just defaults it to what your stuff is set to. Like maybe it knows that I'm running 1080, so it just does it 1080. I don't know. But it looks good. I mean, this looks like a modern game. They definitely cleaned up the menus. Like it looks the same, but it's it's a lot less like shit. I don't know how to say it, but it's definitely cleaned up. Is there a vault in this game to store your shit? Uh, yeah. I believe so. I don't remember where. Isn't it like over here? I honestly don't remember. Oh, is there not? Thought there was. I don't know. I haven't played this one in forever. With the exception of uh, two nights ago when I helped Chris with an arena, and we were like, oof, this is rough. He's level 60, 62, I was 67, and we were getting one-shotted by level 37s. We were like, what? 
the fuck is this? It's in the Underdome? Yeah, that, yeah. Makes sense. So yeah, I'm gonna definitely be cheesing the Mad Moxie DLC again because that stuff is horrible. Yeah, I don't know if I'll stream the DLC if like all the stuff pops retroactively. We'll see. I might not have a we'll see, man. You mean you get your build min max enough for me, streamer? Bye. <laughs> wow. What's up, Delval? How you doing? Access your map. Hold blah, map shows a different point. Oh, you could just do. Oh, okay. Down to cheese it with you again. Sounds good. I'll let you know because, like I said, I was going to do it with Ray. And now that I know that Chris is a level 62 and can carry, we could either do like. I'll do it with him and you guys do it the three of you, or we could team up or whatever. But either way, we'll get that shit done. I'm just going to do everything I can to only do it once. No fucking way do I want to do it more than I absolutely have to. You can have a four-way. Is it true you can transfer your save over and unlocks all achievements? Not all achievements, but some. Like I already popped uh, some some collectibles. Which is awesome. After the stream, I'm just going to do what Joe's doing. He said he's up to 17 achievements unlocked just from fast traveling. Which is awesome, because like I was saying, as much as I love the Borderlands games, I always hated how you got to do like two playthroughs, you got to do all this type of stuff, all this type of stuff. If I can just do like one, just tip, like just normal playthrough on stream, just have to worry about like, um, like story progression achievements and shit, that would be perfect. Oh, I have to buy a shield. You can call me Zed. Um, level crime four. Oh my god! But I'm not level four. Let's see. I have nine hundred sixty-nine bucks. This seventy seven eighty-four, but it's a beast. Can you not get like a free shield? That's fucking lame, gamers. I guess I should just get one of these garbo ones, so that I could actually equip it. Nah, I'll do that. I'll be level 4 in no time. Hey, paid in Firestone. Completed five missions in the Arid Badlands. Oh, unequalized. Whatever. Yeah, the Borderlands 3 cover is so sick. Thank fuck it does the tra claptrap room. Yup, I... For those that don't know, the collectibles in that are so sparse that you basically fight a giant claptrap and the cheese is you shoot its weapons off and then there's a little part that you can hide behind so it can't damage you. I idled it overnight and when I woke up and scavenged for all the collectibles, I got down to the like one slice of pizza that I needed. So ridiculous. Are you doing the free vehicle XP? I don't know what that is. What you talking about, bruv? People don't yet trust you. If I did that cheese, game crashed the next morning when I picked up a single item. I heard of that happening. Maybe it's just because I was playing it on the one? With backwards compatibility? Maybe that's why it didn't, didn't fuck up for me? I don't know. Oh, can I... Can I use this? No, I have to, like, get this in order, right? Actually, I think that's what I'm doing now. I think she was literally saying you'll be able to drive and I spoke over her because I'm a fucking idiot. Oh, you little bitch. God, it's so good. Why must Deluxe be red cover and regular cover be blue for Borderlands 3? I didn't even notice that shit. Wow, look how weird it went. Master Explorer. Kill 25 enemies with explosive weapons. Oh, okay. I guess it said Exploder, not Explorer, and I just don't know how to read. Level tree, man. Uh, I'm a lady. Thank you. 
God, this gun is just decimating them, dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's so brutal. God damn. So shout out to uh, owning the previous games is just getting jacked. XP eventually get. Hold up. Let me pick up this up and then I'll read that. <clears throat> XP. Once you eventually get catch a ride and you need to jump over the gap, you edge your car slightly off the ramp and then hold down the gas for about thirty seconds and you get a couple k XP. Huh. That's cool. Oh, also, I don't, I don't know if this was the thing for the original, considering that they're like uh, advertising it. But this game has four-player split screen, which is sick. So yeah, not only online, but you could also do it um, the couch co-op. That's actually why I got Borderlands Two and why it became one of my favorite games. Is I played. Uh, split screen with three of my best friends one of them was like yo I got this game shiz and you're gonna fucking love it you gotta try it okay and yeah sure enough I was like wow this is right up my alley the cell shading is amazing the art style is so good the guns are incredible the gameplay is super tight and it's hilarious does that mean you need friends yeah it's true Krieg is best boy Apocalyptic King, how you doing? What do you want? Spit it out. Oh, money, dog. TK Baja, I remember you, the Baja man. Oh, I'm already level four. Why did I think it was three? Uh, so in that case, I will equip my shield. Sweet. Hell yeah. You now have a shield damage inflicted upon you will first re be removed from the shield. If your shield goes down, it will re recharge after a short time beyond the lookout for stronger shields. Wait. Good, just playing some Borderlands? Hell yeah, what's that? So yeah, the audio is good and everything, by the way. You guys said it was, uh, said it was good during the cutscenes, but... Hopefully everything still uh, sounds nice and level. If I'm not mistaken, <clears throat> you can go in there, but the bandits are like way too high level for you and you get smoked. Audio seems fine, sweet. I love it when the games uh, like have it set to... Like I don't have to tamper with anything. I could go in, invert my right stick, and that's it. Only that big bird boss in this, and the Tina and the stairs in two. Oh, don't remember it at all. Big bird boss? You mean like the Mothra thing? Tina and the stairs in two. Man, Tina. I love Tiny yeah. Tina. One more step and it'll be your last. <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face. <laughs> Isn't he blind? Hey, why don't you come over here and chat a while? Oh, they rob you, lol. To have company out here. Don't worry about me. I can take care of myself. Goodbye, just fine. Okay. Alright, let's get his food. Stolen food. So the only thing that my camera... Oh my god. The only thing my camera is blocking, by the way, is my ammo. So... I think it's safe to say nobody cares. So I guess when you loot them... You still gotta pick them up, but when they, uh, drop from enemies and whatever... Was that supposed to be their shit? When they drop from enemies or whatever, they just get sucked into you. But, uh, yeah, Lightspeed, you know what? I surprisingly don't remember that much from these games either. Borderlands 2, I remember most of it just because I played it like 8 million times. But I was actually thinking of it, thinking of it today. I was like, for the amount of time that I spent in this game and the pre-sequel, I really don't remember much. Remember like the gist of it, but I feel like I should remember a lot more. Then again, my memory sucks because I'm old and I don't sleep and I drink too much and I play 7 million games a day. So I don't remember tidbits from games that I played three years ago.
When are we gonna have to fight Mama Bear? That's a big old skag whelp. And you're dead. Feel it, feel it. Thought I was able to just sprint over it. And boosh. Nine Toes TK's food. Oh man, it feels good to be back in Borderlands chat. I feel like I'm back at home. I remember a lot of Borderlands series recently went back to clean up Borderlands 1 with a friend to get all the achievements of, like last year or so. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I think it was about two years ago. Actually, I could check right now. Because I loaded up, like I said, Borderlands 1 the other day. So I could tell you. Um. Bow, 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 bow. I completed it <gasps> at the end of June 2017. And I started it. Did I seriously complete it within like a week? Wait, I started the 17th? Okay, no, and the 28th. Still. I did it. I completed it in like two weeks? Jesus Christ. That might have been. That must have been the month that I was home. Smells like off worlder. How you liking our planet anyways? Glitch secret armory secret armory missions for me. Don't worry about me. Still hasn't uh it's fixed, huh? Alright. Earn a skill point. Alright, earn level five. If seven seventeen twenty five out of seventeen fifty, that's fucking You're awful. Well. That is fucking awful. I would be super pissed. Gain the ability to turn invisible and move incredibly fast. Upon entering and leaving phase walk, you create a phase blast that damages nearby enemies. You can melee attack to end phase walk early. You now have an action skill. Press left bumper to use your action skill. After using your action skill, it will be unavailable until it recharges. Pretty sure it still doesn't work. Not going to spend 15 hours to find out. Yeah. I'll go back and set for through playthrough 2 eventually. Sorry, man. Ooh, grenades. Dude, nice. We'll have our ability, we'll have grenades. Boosh, truly outrageous. Killed an enemy with the Siren's action skill. So with hers, you only have to kill one enemy. And with the other guys, I want to say that it's like... 15 or 100, right? If I remember correctly, I just got to this point in the game with every other character. And I just grinded kills here. Or wait, did I have to play more? Fuck, I don't remember actually. It was 15. So maybe, uh, yeah, I just, I got to level 5, unlocked the skill, killed 15 enemies, and then switched to the next one. Those were probably like some of my last achievements. At least for the base game. Because, yeah, I always play with the Lilith and Maya. I always play with the waifus, because they're incredible characters. Did you see Frame Rate Merch has a purple slush beanie for sale? Yup, I want it. If they have any left in... about 12 days? When I, uh, have money in my PayPal? I am definitely gonna get one. Because that thing is fucking nice. Oh, it required me 13! Mordecai, Krieg, and Athena are my three go-to for all three games. That makes sense. Yeah, I started with Athena in pre-sequel. But then, um... Three of the characters had the same thing where you had to kill, like, 15 enemies, 100 enemies, or whatever. And Claptrap, you had to get to level, like, 31 or something for his achievement. So I just played as Claptrap. Again, you already have to play the game, like, at least two, two times. I didn't want to have to play it like 7 million, especially knowing that I had to do two versions over time. It says store closing for two weeks this month, same time as a pre-order for the new crown shorts. Oh, fuck. I guess I gotta get it soon, huh? For the new crown shirts. Is it, are they the, the pizza crown shirts? Or was he doing the galaxy crown again? 
I'll, I'll kill them again for the XP. Might as well. God, this is ridiculous. Pizza, galaxy, and etc. Nice. Well, I definitely want the purple slouch beanie. Because obviously, uh, purple is my jam. Slouch beanies are my jam. And I really like, um... His crown and his frame rate logos. And obviously just supporting a good dude. But I figured I would wait till the... 14th or 15th when I got paid from Twitch, but maybe I'll have to get it before that then. Also available in hoodies according to Ray. Fuck, man. Yeah, they've been going crazy with the store. Did you see the picture of them? Like, they got like a... Basically like a warehouse almost? Because it just, like, grew too fast? It's fucking awesome. Yeah, have you uh, been playing this, Messiah, by the way? The fuck are they? Ow. That's rude. Fuck you, Ubu. His second house for the store, right? Dude, I, uh... Man, if I lived in Austin, I would be like, Dude, just hire me to run your fucking store. That's my bread and butter. God, these- honestly, skags are fucking gross. With their big ass mouth- remember there's like the- In Borderlands 2, what's it called? Like the Alpha Skag or the like... Mega Skag or something? And it's just gigantic? Don't you- yeah, don't you like save a baby only to f have it like eaten by the big one or something? And then you have to kill it and it shoots like a beam out its face? Like Kamehameha's you? Sorry, but the game wouldn't connect online to get old saves, so I just watched Ray. Fair enough. Well, that's fucking annoying. But, um, but did you go into the old game and upload Whoa! your character? Because you gotta do that. You can't just like go load it. You have to go into the original and upload it. I actually like reinstalled the 360 version, um, I don't know, a few days ago? Sometime within the past week. Um... So I got the achievement for discovering it. I'm hoping... Were, were there achievements for having like discovered every name location in this game? Like it has in 2 and pre-sequel? I'm hoping that those retroactively pop with my other Lilith. When I fast travel. I guess we'll find out later. Um, or maybe a... No, nah, actually, I was going to say, maybe I'll end this stream with that, but you guys don't want to just see me literally fast traveling all over the place. I'll just, uh... I'll do that while I'm uploading this to YouTube and working on thumbnails. I'll just... You know, number them off and whatever while I'm waiting for it to load. Um... Yeah, I, I installed the game within the past week to double check, actually, if that was going to be a thing. Because I was like, wait a minute. I remember in Handsome Collection, I imported my Athena. And, uh, and like I was saying, I'd, uh, you know, gone back and forth between my 360 and 1 saves for, uh, achievements for Borderlands 2. So yeah, I went and checked, and then sure enough, they, they added the upload thing, so I was like, fuck yeah, dude. Oh, we gotta find the gun stash and kill nine toes. I'm full. Victoria's full. Uh, okay. Well, none of currently have two slots available for quick switching weapons. Okay. Um. Nine thirteen. Worth one sixteen and eighty nine. What's my least valuable? Forty bucks. Thirty bucks. Well, goodbye, and goodbye. I'll take these and we'll sell them. I will make all the monies. All the money.
I assume I can't change it to like a single round instead of a three round burst. Well, so I don't remember how I had my build set with Lilith, but whatever. We'll just we'll just do something new, I guess. What did you say? You get XP boost right now. I'm killing dudes, getting like 13 XP. Play through two secret armory. Bitches were scaling to one level higher than me. Oh, really? Uh, right. Uh, let's see. What do I want here? Um, increases the capacity of your shield. Your melee attacks can daze enemies, reducing their movement speed and accuracy. Increases your fire rate with all weapons. Increases your chance of causing elemental effects with elemental weapons. Increases your critical hit damage. Increases your resistance to damage for a few seconds after phase walking. 14% damage reduction? Hmm. Fuck, I like all of this, man. What's the end game here? Each bullet you fire has a chance to daze enemies, reducing... Okay. Killing an enemy causes you to deal fire damage to nearby enemies and make your shots not always cause ammo for a few seconds. The fire damage increases with your level. Using a melee attack while phase walking deals additional damage. Fuck. Resistance to elements. Hmm. Corrosive damage. Let's increase our fire rate. For now. If I kill them fast, they won't hit me. <clears throat> but that's awesome, Chris. I hope that happens to me, because then uh, I could hit 68 somewhat quickly and... Uh, all that shit. All right, so now let's just sell all the poop. Oh, sell junk. It doesn't let me sell. Okay. Let me just kill these assholes. I didn't realize it didn't pause when you were at the uh, store. All right, you're dead. What? What's the damage that I'm dealing? Hold up. I think it was like 20, right? I'm dealing 28 and 20. So I could sell literally all of this shit. Cool, man. At least that gives you a nice little... Uh, nice little boost money-wise and inventory space-wise. I remember a handsome collection was the same. You got like loyalty reward guns. So you didn't really have to worry about money and guns and shit for at least a little bit. Obviously, it won't take long before these are useless. But for the time being, doing 20 damage is a hell of a lot better than 7. So I am all about it, my dudes. I need to use my phase walking more. I never... I never do. I used to use my phase locking with Maya all the time. Oh, yeah, this guy. <laughs> you woke the wrong dog. Ah, yeah. Nine toes. Also, he has three balls. I love the humor in these games. Yeah, fucking wreck, boy. Pinky and Digit. Is that a purple already? Oh my god, am I gonna die? Holy shit. We got purples already? I knew they increased the loot drops, but word? We're getting purples on the first boss? Also, I saw Borderlands 3, I don't know if you guys saw, but one of the pre-order bonuses, uh, cause you could obviously, you know, what's up Kaiser, how you doing? Shinies, right? Um, so you could pre-order the standard edition of Borderlands 3, which is the game. Then you, there's obviously the season pass, I th think they said there's four DLCs, and that's obviously gonna be awesome. Um, but I saw... Besides skins and so on, one of the pre-order bonuses for like the Ultra Amazing Edition is you get an XP and loot booster. 
So I was like, hmm, what kind of boost are we talking here? But as somebody who's going to most likely 100% go for all the achievements, that should add up when you're going for level 50, I'm thinking. So... Hmm... Is that motherfucking she's black and not just regular she's black uh, motherfucking she's black only comes out on Fridays when there's beer nearby? That's funny. I don't care who you are, that's funny. Uh, does this game also have the achievement for having a purple in every slot? Oh, this one- wait, what? 10, 20, 30, 40? So that's a hundred gamer score right there that could theoretically pop with my other character. Ooh! Okay, 50. Kill 5 rack in under 10 seconds. Sell 50 guns to shop. I I'll worry about it later. But I just saw this. This is 50 damage? Are you serious? Is this a sniper? Fuck, dude. I'll leave it aside for now. Because I'm liking my combat rifle and shotgun combo. But I can definitely see myself um, doing that because I like snipers and I like damage. Where am I going? Oh, turn in. Okay. Oh, baby, it feels good. It feels so good to be back in the borderlands and have it all nice and pretty. Like I said, I'm gonna get Handsome Collection again. Not even to play, just to help that Ray. First step on your journey. I figured with the amount of times he's raided me and dropped important. bits and donations first and whatever, I was like, yeah, I can, I can justify spending like 15, 20 bucks on a game that I'm not gonna play. They will try to use you and you cannot be swayed in your purpose. The vault is here and we will find it. I mean, even just just my 500,000 gamer score stream, you had dropped fucking 500 bucks. So, yeah. And I actually, I want to see how it looks even in 1080. Uh, I want to see how it looks with the visual upgrades. Thought you had the handsome collection? I had it on disc. So once I completed it, I uh, traded it in. I got like two cents for it, but I was just like, well... It's just going to collect dust. I might as well just get rid of it. And uh, I've been like phasing out discs over time. Like I only have... As far as Xbox goes, I only have two discs. And it's the pre-sequel and the 360, which again, I only have to complete with... Uh, with Ray. And it was... I only got it on disc because it was like 10 bucks versus like 60. And then um, I have Halo 4 and it was... Because I had found out that uh, the multiplayer achievements, the multiplayer achievements, was it like they all, I think some stuff got like discontinued or something. So like just popping the disc in makes the achievements pop. So I, so I don't know, something like that. It was just, so again, I got it for like just a few bucks. I loaded the game in, got like 200 gamer score. Cool. Awesome. But yeah, the uh, they didn't even have the cover. So it's like handwritten. So I can't do anything with it. So. And then I have uh, Smash Bros. I have the, well, the cartridge, but I have the case. I should have gone digital. I just wasn't sure. I wasn't 100% sure that I would want to keep it. Because obviously we all know I was really hesitant to get it just because um, cause I've played so much Melee and Rivals of Ether, and that's what I like to play. Um, I didn't know 100% sure if I would like Smash Ultimate, so I was like, you know what, just in case... I'll go physical, that way if I'm not a fan, I can bring it back. <laughs> How'd you get Borderlands 3 early? I know a guy. What's up, DDA? How you doing, man? Boom, 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 boom. Hey, Hello, sir. Bye. Level 7? Another skill point? Are you for serious? I should be just meleeing them and saving ammo. Imagine never having the battles we had if you never got smashed, right? 
When I raffle stomp you with Pichu and shit? Bro. Kaiser, how you doing, man? What you up to? Actually, those... Uh, fuck it. Let's see what kind of XP we're getting from these guys now. I think I think they're still level 3 and I'm already 7. <clears throat> you know what? Let's just do this. Oh, sh... Yeah, XP-wise, it's not really doing anything already. Oh, Vel. Let's see. Let's refresh my memory. I feel like in here they're super OP. And I'll get moited. But out of curiosity. Okay. Level 9 might be too... Oh, okay, level 11 and there's like a... Sign over his head basically saying, don't. Oh shit. I fucked up, dude. I fucked up, dude. Oh no. I'm gonna get fucking wrecked. How did he hit me from there? What? Okay, stay there, buddy. <laughs> I'm a legend. Dude, I am the badass of the Borderlands. I'm the badass. What the fuck's it? It's badass siren. Killing the badass psycho. She's BL cheese. Yo, I can't wait till he breaks free and one shots me though. So I guess he's supposed to just stay in this area compared to the other guys that venture out. Balls! I'm the best! Dude, I am amazing. I am amazing, son. Hell yeah. <laughs> you received a grenade mod. Oh, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. It's just like aim, enemies have levels. Oh, just like you. I was like, what? That's amazing. I can't believe that worked. I'm used to I'm used to breaking or glitching games. I'm not used to like working in my favor. Usually it's just like I get stuck in a wall or something. I'm not used to it being like, here's some free uh, XP, bro. Enjoy. Mary, what's up? How you doing? Welcome back. That was awesome. Turn into mission for 13,000 XP and it's like a dick hair on my progress bar, right? Yeah, it's gonna be gross. And you're... you're level like, what, 40-something, you said? And that's where babies come from. I guess that's the spawn point. Interesting. Take care are gross. They are. You think we would have evolved enough by now to not need body hair? Trimming the brush makes the tree look bigger. Yeah, and you don't get hairballs. When you go blah, 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 blah. J 
job hunting. So this is the bounty board, right? Work on more than one uh, mission at a time. Missions can be marked as active. Your HUD will display the waypoint and objectives for active mission. Yeah, so you know. The use. Catch a ride near Firestone is more busted than my mama's girl parts. Real appreciate you taking a poke at that. Uh, the system, not my mom. Huh. Uh, down the skag den, know what I'm saying? 42. I can't imagine how little, ex how little that's gonna be for me. Why is it not what? Why can't I take them? Huh. Um. Yeah, I can't imagine if you're getting like a daycare of XP at 42, I can't imagine what it's going to be like for me at 67. It's just going to be... But, uh, like I said, after the stream, I will fast travel everywhere like you suggested. And I'll check out that secret armory area Chris was talking about. But, is, can you go there on playthrough 2, like right from the get-go, Chris? We need to get to 50 and 61. Oh, 61 as well? I thought so. I don't know why people say draw letters with the tongue during oral. All you need is B, L, and E. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Amazing. I usually, I, uh, I usually do the Arabic alphabet. Ooh, a shiny button. Yo, Mary, thank you for the 16-month resub. You're not a skag, are you? No? Well, lucky you. Rup. All right. Uh, I gotta get. Scar I have to kill Scar and get his leg back. I believe Scar is a big old skag, but I don't remember. Dude, this is so fun. Also, F to anybody who cares about like the little, the little chit chat. With like Baja and stuff. Don't get me wrong, it's good. It's funny. But on the like 18th playthrough, I kind of really only care about the main cutscenes. I'm not really going to uh, freak out over all the little quips. As much as this game is amazing. Have you gotten your Mario achievement? What's that one again? You gotta jump and stomp down on someone's head to kill them? Oh yeah, I guess it's easier to do now so I don't one-shot them, right? I guess you could get it at any point, right? I don't remember. I, I honestly, like, the achievement list, I don't really remember a whole lot. Easiest to do now since enemies are weak as shit. Okay. Um, hopefully I don't one shot them. Well. Okay, if I do that, it pauses it. Do I have anything, like... Oh, I should have done it on him. Oh, I can. God damn it. Got it. Thank you for reminding me. My brother's an Italian plumber. Is he Luigi? Sweet. Yeah, thanks, man. I uh, I did not remember that. I like how it, there's a 360 no scope achievement in the pre sequel, and it's like stupid easy because you float. Fuck the Mimics and the Tiny Tina DLC scare the shit out of me. I'm trying to remember Mimics in that game. What you talking, bruv? Oh, grenade mods, right. Grenade damage goes down. Uh, Merv grenades. When Merv grenades explode, they throw out several more grenades. 
Longbow grenades teleport to their destination and explode. Let's do the uh, longbow shit. Fuck it. That's why I say fuck it. Oh my god, I have to go all the way around to get- Fuck you, dude. Use a bitch. Nice jump, dude. You murdered, son. You murdered. Some of the chests in the deals here mimics and they pop out fast. I wow. I totally forgot about that. That's amazing. Welp. I got that one? Yo, bless up, auto aim. That was all you fam. Yo, that Michael Dublé though. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, gamers. Uh yeah, I guess I really have to wait, what? No. I have to go up there? Yes, okay. Always let rain open to chest and tiny Tina. Well, I do I don't remember that at all. That's hilarious. Yo, fucking mimics in Gungeon are some bullshit. Actually, they're changing um, how mimics work in this update. Like, they give rewards now, I believe, uh, upon killing them. Especially pedestals. Because they changed that in the last update. You can literally kill a boss. And then you go to the pedestal where your item or your your weapon is there as like your reward, and it'll be a fucking mimic. So now that those like drop rewards and shit, which is nice because yeah, that's a it was really annoying. I think Ray has a clip where he like rinses a boss and has half a heart, and then just out of nowhere, it's a mimic and it one shots him. And then they added wall mimics and stuff. Oh, right, the rocks. Hello. I need to kill five within 10 seconds for an achievement. I feel like this won't work. Oh, I don't have any left. Unless they all bomb me at once. Hold up. Dude, I am a genius. I'm a fucking genius, gamers. Hell yeah, that was cool. I think I did it in the car, that makes sense. Just use the turret. Mimics were such a waste of time. Uh, yeah, kind of annoying. I was just gonna say that rack achievement is as easy as hell. Can I have my moment, guys? Can you let me have this? <laughs> yeah, it's super easy. I like it in Borderlands 2. There's an achievement for um, killing a rack with like a TDR weapon or whatever, like the explody ones. The ones where like you, yeah, you re when you reload, you throw them and they explode. It's just, I don't know why it was funny to just throw your gun in the air like you just don't care. Why can't he just have something nice? Exactly. Mary gets it. I'm so bad at Gungeon, but at least I got two golden bullets so far. I'm bad at Gungeon, says the guy who's like only missing one achievement to complete it. And it's a fucking easy one. Get a load of this guy over here, dude. Listen over here. Didn't I already have the data recorder? There's no fall damage in this game, right? I don't think so. Oh, I have a skill point. Because I'm such a skilled gamer, my dudes. <laughs> okay. Okay, lol. Yeah. So yeah, like I was saying, um, you guys can expect the next two, three weeks basically just be uh, this and enter the gungeon, honestly. This is going to be a lot to do. They're good games. I want the completions. There was a point where I played entirely too much and it was not quite so bad, fair enough. Yeah. I feel that. I got rusty as shit too. The original, this bitch is empty, yeet. Uh, 
Um, so, I need to go up and over. Okay. Um, I don't remember if there's an achievement in this game to do all level 1 challenges with a character, but I'm going to assume that there is. I have to go up there? Uh... Hmm. There's not? That was only in two and... I think it was in pre-sequel as well, right? Well, that's fucking good. I'm assuming there's... Yeah, you do all the missions, do all the side missions, including... Cromorax. Does that mean I have to redo Cromorax on this playthrough? That just hit me. Fuck, I think I have to do Cromorax again, right? But I can't use my 67. I wanna die? God damn it. I totally forgot about that. So I basically do need to do two playthroughs with this character. Unless I get lucky. And re-fighting Cromorax on my other character pops it. Since he has his own achievement, but he also cancels one of the missions for the completed all missions and knocks DLC. <laughs> this game's poopy. This game's just a big old bucket of farts. Can you stop spitting on me? Spitters are quitters, G. Using my hunter skill once triggered the achievement? Yo, you're triggering me, okay? Oh, that's good to know. Yeah. Nox is a fun DLC, but I hate playing it. Pardon? Running over one enemy triggered it? Okay, so you could just do one of each thing to trigger the achievements, it sounds like. So maybe after the stream, I'll just, like I said, I'll fast travel everywhere with her, like you were saying. Honestly, I hope that starting this playthrough didn't, like, somehow fuck that up. But I don't see why it would. It should be tied to her, not to me. Or, you know what I mean. Oh, I have no grenades. I do have a phase walk, though. You can't phase me, lol. I'm kind of glad I didn't equip the sniper rifle right now. Although, I'm gonna die. Godless. Ow. No fast travel in the DLC in the mission. Had to go from one end. Oh, yeah. You had to go from one end to the other over and over. Fuck. My mission's just shitty level design. Now, that's called padding, my dude. That was just the definition of padding. They're like, hey, we have three hours of content. How can we make it seem like we have ten? I know. Let's just make them waste their fucking time. I totally forgot that I need eight of those things. Fuck me. Hopefully I didn't like miss too many, but I probably did. Okay. It's fine. I feel like we're leveling up at a pretty decent pace here, by the way. But again, I... I, no, I I'm basing that off nothing. I just feel like I'm almost level 10, which is pretty quick. But then it obviously slows down like any game. I want to say that in the Borderlands series, for those who don't know, you if you do all the side missions, you tend to finish the game around level 35. It's about there. I like how she just like maniacally laughs after she's just killing shit. I love Lilith. If I remember correctly, Maya is just as fucked up and that's why I love them. Besides being hot as shit and tattooed. Uh, 
right, let's see. What is this? What is this shiny little thing? Uh, oh, I'm full. Cool. Uh, let me see what's the least valuable again. $28, huh? Yeah, go away, please. Uh, Alright, let's see. Is this shield better than my current shield? Recharge rate. Let's see, compare. Recharge rate is the same. Fire resistance is the same. It's literally the exact same thing. Oh, it's, cause it's comparing it with... The, I'm an idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. Um, Fast recharge, and that one's fire resistant. Let's do that. Fuck it. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Level 13. Okay. Um, Oops. Keep doing that. Been playing too many games that are similar. And so I kind of mix up some controls here and there. It's looking like if you do all the bounties or missions in an area and you load in on playthrough one, you can't trigger them to unlock the achievement or do five missions and such and such. Yeah, that's exactly what I was expecting. You have to redo that. So that's like I was saying, if you if you were to do all missions except for one, then doing that last one would pop it. But those are sounding like they're the ones that need to be ticked. And you can't tick them. Which is what I was expecting. I was expecting to have to do at least one, like, 100% playthrough of, like, every side mission. And all that, which I want to do anyways. For the, for the fun. And for the stream. Part of me was like, hey, maybe I'll replay Borderlands 2 and pre-sequel on stream while I'm at it. But no. <laughs> as much as I love them, it's just too much time. For games that I've already streamed to death ages ago. Unless I spaced them out. We're, it's what, five months until Borderlands 3? Maybe every like two months, month and a half, two months, we could do just like a normal playthrough. No extra stuff. Like I would have no choice but to do side missions to be high enough level. Keep doing that. Keep, to be high enough level to, like, be able to actually play the game. Um, I want to say that's like 20 to 30 hours, so that's still like a week of streams. That'll still be a long time. But we'll see. May, if people are down, maybe we could do that every month and a half, two months. We'll do like Borderlands 2 and then we do Borderlands pre-sequel. And then uh, obviously Borderlands 3 on launch. And I don't think I have any Borderlands content on my YouTube channel. So it'd be nice to have the whole series there too. Um, Gotta take that. Let's see. What is craptastic? Well, this is worth 87. A wallet does a lot of damage. Now we we got better snipers. So no. I never got the level 50 achievement. I got 51 and 61, so I need to get another character to 50. Oh my god, dude, you had the worst luck. <laughs> you have a YouTube channel, bro. Rude. I saw your, all your stupid fucking first comments, by the way. A level 51 work? Who, me? I didn't get any level achievements yet. But I also haven't leveled her up. Wait, where is I going? Right, I, I have to go up there, but I can't yet, right? Or am I just dumb? So let me see what my missions are here, because I want to see what the hell I'm doing. Wait, what the fuck is that? Right, you could level up your weapon proficiencies. Right. So if I do that, will it... 
Will it, uh... Oh. Okay. Well, I guess let's go back and just get this while we're here. I'm already getting all turned around. We're an hour and a half in. GG's. Alright. Man, this feels good. Yo, Derek! With that spicy host. What a guy! Dude, thanks, man. I was a sick hero. Did you win the games? Where the fuck am I going, dude? Oh, I gotta go back to the entrance. Herder? So I went... Like, I basically went outside to go, I need to go back inside, to go inside and go, I need to go back outside. Dude, I'm good at games. Let me just, um, let me just put it out there. I'm the best. Okay? Don't you ever forget it. Almost beat New Game Plus in two hours? I told you, it's a fucking baby game, dude. Man, Sekiro's so hard, man. Dude, you can even respawn and get two lives, it's a baby game. But for real, that's crazy. Two hours. Is that an achievement or did you just want to do it? The best hell with the rest. Yeah, Mary. Mary knows what's up. Am I just like trapped here forever now? What the hell is this? Hello? Fuck you. Oh, there's another plant. Okay, well. Helps if you jump, Lilith. Just saying. Oh, and there's another one. Yeah, I, I guess if I had noticed that I needed these, things would have gone a lot smoother. Oh my god. Oh my god. How the f- How? What? Super baby game, no, I was just trying to rush it because the last two bosses I need to fight are at the end of the quote-unquote bad ending. Okay. Fair enough. Are you, uh, do you like the game? Now that you're like a beast at it, or? You still think it's, it's stupid garbage? Okay, that one's done. Um. Oh, that I just have to use the thing? I'm an idiot. Yeah, okay, I need to get up there. Oh, maybe this mission sets off this? No, how do I get there, dude? Hello? Chat? Am I blind? How do I get this thing lowered? That grenade is nuts, so that is actually ridiculous. I really like it. Uh, is this any good? Not really, and it's cheap, so fuck it. I'm trying to see if there's like a way I could just cheese some jumps. You fuck. You fuck. Come on, Lilith. Come on, Lilith. You can do it. I believe in you. What if I crouch jump? Up! Fuck the police. Fuck, fuck, fuck the police. Oh, you could have just gone there? Whatever, shut up. <laughs> Nailed it. I'm the best. I'm the best. You're all jealous. Okay. So shout out to Scar. Is that a Lion King reference? Dude, everything the light touches 
will accuse the light in 20 years of sexual harassment. Uh, okay, there's his leg. What am I going to do about my legs, Charlie Murphy? Cool. Does this make a Simba? I guess so. Interesting. I didn't know that Lilith was a furry. Uh, meh. Super meh. Like, really meh. But, it was 120 something? 96? But the damage though. Eh. I need a bigger backpack already. We just started. I got a uh, skill point. My life is filled with HR moments. What did you do? Uh, I guess let's turn in. For what? <laughs> Can I like? Oh, now it's closed. Oh, now you now you want to play nice, bitch. Okay, okay. So from here, just go around and GTFO. Nice try, idiot. Didn't you know that I'm the expert gamer who does the expert things? I really like that effect when you zoom in. Or like just from distance, like how it blurs and then when you're... Get your reticle on them, it clears up. It's super nice. And I like that they added the field of view slider. It's so weird already... Already just like tossing shit or just leaving stuff on the ground. When we're like... Level 9. It, it feels so bad just leaving loot, but it is what it is. That I might use. Oh. 97? Bruh? Well, that one does less damage than that, but it's... Fire. So we'll sell you. We'll sell you. And you. And you, and you. <laughs> Mary. I know I knew what you meant. That's crazy though. Good luck. Um Oh, literally it just does one more damage, but everything else is way worse. Okay, we'll just sell that. Fuck it. Okay. Neat. Neat, neat, neat. Oh, shit. Hello. I'll, although, look at the money. Although, I have like almost nine grand now? When the hell did that happen? Uh. Huh. Yeah, I'm just gonna get this. Fuck it, dog. Fuck it, dog. Uh, 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 uh. Alright. We Gucci. Actually, do you have any grenade mods here? I guess not, but what about... Yeah. Oh, upgrade. Storage tech. Increase your shotgun ammo capacity to 100... Oh, shit. That's... That's how you do it? What was it in... In 2, it was the black market, right? With Iridium? And then in, in pre-sequel, I don't remember what it was. Sticker grenades are good. Huh. This is super dope. Yo, 420? I had to do it to him. I had to do it to him. Didn't I just buy this? You can't use that. What's up, Maka? How's it going, man? 
shotgun ammo. Sure, man. All right, let's not spend too much money yet. I'm still a brigadier broke bitch. Was moonstones in the pre-sequel? That's what I thought. I remember grinding moonstones. There and at levels. There was this like Godzilla type monster right near the beginning of the game. There was like a little cave with uh some lava and stuff. And yeah, he was a boss that I went like right after I beat the game, and I grinded like five to ten levels there. He was really rough at first, but eventually, like, it was it was an easy fight, and it still gave a lot of XP, and it gave a lot of moonstones. Is this the Dark Souls of looter shooters? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. This guy gets it, chat. This guy gets it. Maka, what you up to, man? How you doing, boo-boo? You have any plans of playing this? I'd assume not, but... Are you, were you ever in Borderlands? One of my favorite series. For shout out. Driving Essentials is the Dark Souls of Dark of Educating Driving Simulators. Man, I liked your clip uh that you put on Twitter where like a car just like morphed into a bicycle and you failed. Or something. That game was uh Well it's not a game. It's a lifestyle. No, but it's um I mean to be fair, it's meant to be like an actual driving tutorial, it's just very weird. Definitely overpriced. But um, that being said, I turned it into a meme stream and had a blast. Then I did the completion off camera and it was... Um, I think I worked it well. I think I made it funny. Okay, but can I have an automobile please? No? Okay. Cool. Did that never happen to you? I think it was a scripted event. Um, no, the only time I hit a bike was on purpose. Because I'm a fucking asshole. Oh man, did it... No, nobody clipped the, uh, the cheese here before. That would have been good. So I had, uh, I had a thing where there was a, a badass psycho in the back here. And I like lured him out, but then he wouldn't go past a certain point, and he wasn't moving, and he wasn't attacking. So I just rinsed him. And uh, he was like two, three levels higher than me, and I just rocked his fucking face apart. It was really funny. Thanks for the XP, dog. Uh. God, I'm such a beast. Lilith, I love you. Where'd you go, bitch? Where'd you go, dog? Okay. Boneheads the what is all this? All this money. Whoa, I have ten thousand five hundred seventy-nine dollars. Wasn't I just at like sixty six hundred? And I got a purple bone shredder. Oh, it's a smegma gun. It's a it's a smug. I wanna say that I had these like, this like disgusting SMG on my other Lilith. I don't know. Chat, maybe I'll do like the fast travel. Actually, no. Like I said, never mind. I'll do that while I do the YouTube stuffs. I get circumcised. Where do I keep my smeg? But dude, that was so funny. That was a quality, quality meme. I'm a fan. Rocket launcher runner or machine gun? Let's do rockets. Uh, yeah. There we go. Oh my God! Hello. Analog driving though, you gotta love it. Pretty sure I went the wrong way. No, we're good. Oh shit, hello. Uh, it's left bumper, right? Guess we'll find out. I missed that by a mile. JK lol. I did the... Uh, I did it. I did it, gamers. 
You know what? As far as analog driving goes, this actually works really well. Oh my god. That thing just, like, disintegrated. Sorry, buddy. Am I even getting XP at this point? There we go. Whoops. Alright, we good. Yo, what up, Hicks? How's it going, buddy? Welcome back. Oh, yeah, I remember this area. Isn't there, like, a what's-his-face? There's, like, a dude? Very specific, I know. Oh, yeah, bruisers. Those guys take fucking lumps, dude. Chat, you also... You notice how Maka never answered my question? Of if you played Borderlands? Because he doesn't want to be exposed as a fake gamer. A fake gamer grill. But we fucking caught him red-handed, dude. This guy, are you serious? Are you for real? What if I, oh. Get shit on, fam. Is that? Is there somebody down? Isn't this where the Mothra motherfucker shows up? I hope that it's a specific mission. I don't remember if it just randomly shows up because that thing will just ruin you. Cool, and now I think that this is just open forever, right? That's like a shortcut? Is that what the whole spiel is? Alright, why don't you come on back? I got something for you. <gasps> for me? Yeah. But it's not my birthday? Alright, skill point. Boom! Alright, next. Uh, resistance to fire, shock, corrosive, and explosive damage. Or, you deal shock damage to nearby enemies while phase walking. Uh, we'll take... We'll resist damage. I feel like that's going to be very useful with bosses and such. Is this, like, later or something? Also, why does this, like, look terrible compared to everything else? It's like the one thing that looks atrocious. I'll leave my car there for a second. I'm just going to, like, loot and shoot and fucking toot. I don't know why, but that little wow made me think it was a bandit car in the background. I'm losing my mind, bruv. Uh, refresh my memory, did the different bounty boards have different bounties? I assume so, right? Hey, man. He just shakes his head like I'm not talking to you. Right, and different shops have different stuff. Let me see if I could just... Can I go here and then come back? Have I been here before? I just want to see if it gives me the achievement for discovering something. Oh, Delval, you went back and che uh, clipped the cheese? That's awesome. Thanks, homie. You've discovered outpost the Arid Hills. I think I remember this place. I don't want to be here right now. Oh. Welcome to the Badlands. And I'm loving this so far. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoy this because... uh. I'm a full-time Borderlands streamer now. <laughs> I always do that. I get focused on the game, and I forget to finish my coffee, and then it's cold and gross, and I'm tired. Chat, am I an idiot? Don't answer that. Uh, alright, so let's get an automobile, and we'll, uh... We'll go return to Zed. Enjoy it more if you co op like the old days. No, I mostly um, want to solo this one because, like I said, I'm going to be back and forth between this and Gungeon. So, um, you know, on a day where I want to play Gungeon, I don't want it to be like, hey, Joe, I'm not playing Borderlands today. And then if you wanted to co op everything together, you're stuck waiting for me and whatever. You know? I figured it makes it just makes more sense to uh, solo it all. Ow. Rude? Bitch? Yeah, I literally don't even get XP. Like, it's not even a little XP, it's just no XP. Well, so much for that then.
but like where are they? They're like outside, but they're blocked by my car. That's amazing. All right, Zed, what's up, fam? You find a fella named Shit near the crossroads. On Receive the weapon slot storage deck. Storage deck has a lock a new weapon equip slot. You can now equip three weapons at a time. Boy howdy. Boy howdy, G gamers. Let's, uh, for this guy, let us equip a sniper rifle. Whoa. Yeah, we're gonna do this guy. Beautiful. What's the situation I'm in stuck with? I'm in Scotland, the friend I'm doing co-op with is an American with a bad sleeping schedule, so getting to play is a hassle. Yeah, I feel you. That and just like with streaming, I just... Especially streaming, I generally tend to just want to do shit solo. Unless it's something like... If it's something like Apex Legends or something where you could just like hop in and out, cool, whatever. But when it's a story, I just like, I don't like to have to plan if somebody's not available, if like two out of three people are available, then, you know, you gotta either wait or somebody misses out. So, yeah, it's just, it's a pain in the ass for nothing. Unless it's like, um... I don't know, like, like, when Borderlands 3 comes out, like, maybe, because I know that, like, I'll play nothing but that, and same as the people I'd team up with. So that's easier. But like I said, when it's like something like this, where I'm bouncing back and forth, and... Uh... I'm kind of going to be playing it, I guess, a bit sporadically in the sense of, like... One character is going to be there to do all the hard shit, and it'll probably be off camera, and then I'll just do, like, the main... Playthrough, okay? I don't know. Too wonky. I loaded into T Bone Junction playthrough two. The first mission it gives me rewards thirty eight hundred XP as level fifty one difficulty. Yeah, I think it's because the DLCs, the DLCs, if I'm not mistaken, are like in order of what level you would be. Like, um. Like, I think it's going based off the fact that if you were level 50 from doing the two playthroughs, right? Oh shit, I have to do roll kill. Whoops. If I'm not mistaken. So it's like... It's... It's ju uh, basing it off that you're 50 and then you go into the first DLC and then after that it'll be a bit higher and so on. I could be wrong. But they, de they definitely have the levels in order of how they come out. You obviously get progressively harder and shit. Hello. Goodbye. Oh. Okay, I have to go there. Let me just see if there's any goodies here first. I don't remember if you could... I don't think you could fast travel in vehicles, can you? Maybe? Guess we'll find out. No. That's fine. <clears throat> instant health files give you an instant boost of health when you pick them up. Yeah. Oh, this game autosaves, right? That's it. That's the logo up there. Okay. New... Yeah, I guess you can't save on your own. Yeah, just in case, let's get some of this, yeah? 20 health or 40 health? I need... Quite a bit. Also, I just realized it's 210 bucks, Jesus. Look how pretty that thing is. What the fuck is happening? Yup, it's the Chrome Rocks, dudes. Uh, level 15? Yeah, have fun with that, bitch. Sayonara. I'll be back uh, another day. Yeah, when you quit to main menu, it saves. But you can see the um, on the top left, the Borderlands logo, or the Vault logo, I should say, is um, autosave.
Oh man, this is so good. Fucking Borderlands makes my wiener tingle, dog. Alright, uh, let's see what we got here. So that was level... Difficulty impossible, yeah. Cool. That one's trivial already. But two more data recorders in Sky Gl Oh, you know what? That one was super easy, but I was an idiot and didn't see the loop around. Fuck. I like that it saves your settings for the... for the vehicles. How do I get back there? Just like this, right? Yeah. Yeah, fun fact for those that don't, didn't know. The visual style of Borderlands was actually a very, very late decision. I mentioned it before. Quite a few times, actually, on stream. But, um... Yeah, it was going to be more realistic. And then they kind of had that decision of like, you know what? Our game doesn't stand out enough. And very, very late in the development cycle, they decided to change it to cell shading and all that, which is very risky because that's obviously a lot of work and a lot of money to spend very late. But it worked out because it did exactly what they wanted to do and made it stand out. And now that's, like, one of the main things it's known for. <laughs> Besides, it's, like, humor and a billion bajillion guns. Uh, so I have to go up here. Right, we're gonna go into the other area. And all that shit, okay. Oh, wow. I never noticed the lights before. I like that I, like, smashed in to a wall. <laughs> and that triggered the lights turning on. Just like in real life, dude. So this is, I guess, a save point, or a checkpoint, or whatever. Cool, dog. Q Q. Whoa, Warface gets Xbox One X enhancements. I just loaded up True Achievements to check something. That's awesome. Oh wait, I said Warface. I was thinking Warframe. Really? Warface? People play that shit still? Your Warframe is a super dope game. I actually wanted to install it on the Switch just to see how it ran. But just because I'm curious. I have no intention of playing it on the Switch. Especially considering I've had that game for, I want to say, like 17 years now on the Xbox and I played it like three hours. got disconnected and startled me and I realized it was because Carly had signed in. <clears throat> One second, let me kill these assholes. Carly had signed into me on her console and made it the home console. Fucking F. Yeah, as much as game sharing sounds practical sometimes, it also sounds very impractical sometimes. I think I'm going to turn off these tutorial things. I'm assuming that was a training message. Maybe this one has to disappear, but yeah, hopefully from now on they don't uh, pop up. They're just too, they're too big. They stay around for too long. Yo, just like my erections, huh? <laughs> Shit. Uh, let's see, what are we gonna do? We said resistance, yeah? She's black, it's now 11. It's weird, I feel like I'm leveling up real fast. I guess I just forgot how fast you shoot up and then how fast it slows down. Ow. Um, rude? Thank you? Oh yeah, the racks. Rack city bitch, rack rack city bitch. Am I right gamers? Yo, B B Barack Obama, am I right gamers? Where'd they go? Oh, uh, they ran away from my shitty jokes. That's it, come my pretties. What's happening? Uh, before we turn in, for what? Uh, 
Uh, let's see. So those are done. What is this? Talk to Shep Sanders near the crossroads. Oh, that was the fucking guy that. Ah, oh, you idiot, bitch. That was the guy that was what I went to, and I tried to speak to him, and he's like, "Uh, uh." I literally just had to activate the mission. What a dumbass. What a stupid anus head. All right, it's fine. It's no problem, friend. We do no problem. Mary, have you ever played these games? Also, Mary, was it you that was playing the Deponia games? But FYI, uh, they they brought like 14 fucking Deponia games to Xbox out of nowhere. I have like three of them installed. I've yet to turn them on. I didn't know they were point and clicks. I'm interested. But it also means that they might be easy completion. So I'll probably just be... Uh, a scumbag and use a guide to just bang them out real quick. Thinking if I'm going to do a second playthrough, then it'll be on 360 so I can export to the one so I can get the achievements for hitting the levels on both consoles. I would do that. Get to like 49 and then like 80% or something. And then export it. Pop it real quick on the one, then go back on a 360, pop it. You know what I mean? I haven't played these. I did not like Deponia, really. Oh, it was Lily that played the Deponia. Oh no, you have to play the Deponia. Okay, I think... Wait, did Lily gift me a Deponia game on Steam or something? Something like that. Yeah, are, the, uh, are they point and clicks? And it's... Wait, if they're... If they are, then that's a bad sign, because Eternal loves point and clicks, and she just said she didn't like Deponia. So that means it'd be fucking god-awful, then. They are, but the solutions are insanely weird and bad. Oh, cool. My fave! Sit. Forever. <laughs> little boop on the nose. Not rational at all. Great. Alright, so guide it is. Thank you. Whoop. Good to know. Whee. I should have went to the bounty board while I was there. I'm an idiot. Ah, whatever. It's fine. Also, the female character is a robot named Goal, and in Chaos, the whole point is to woo her three personalities. Okay. What? Alright, I guess we'll do these. Because they're my level. Did not lie, it's awful. It's just... What? So she has like, split personalities, you gotta woo all of them? You gotta be like the super alpha male? Elder Skag? Eternal! <laughs> Look who it is! Whoa! Was the super misogynistic game you hated? Uh, starts with a D, but not the good kind of D. Yeah, what the hell was it called? Oh shit, badass corrosive guy. Can I run it over? Yeah, I can. Okay, I'm just gonna stay in a car forever then. Um, D. Hmm. Remember the dev actually emailed me asking if I wanted a, a copy of the stream, and I didn't even answer after everything you had told me about it. Fuck, what was it called? It was the same dev that did Riddle Corpse's EX. <laughs> Division, that's it. It's the Division 2 and I was like, not not on my channel. Oops. Right here we respect the woman. What the fuck was it? It was the 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 do daddy do do. D D uh, Dingleberry fuck machine. That's it. Kablamo. Uh. Oh, that's not a shotgun. 
That is. Uh-oh. I really like that that, as, that scratch mark it leaves when you get uh, cut by one of these fuckers. It's a really cool effect. I mean, it's annoying as shit, but it's cool. Oh my god, I'm dead. Give me the health. Oh no. Give me my fucking face. Oh no. Oh, right, this thing. I forgot about that. Hell yeah. Second win, bitch. Uh. Yeah, so that was not worth it. Oh my god. I almost got demolished. That would have been expensive. Demetrios, that's it. Dementors. I rage one K'd it so no one could say I didn't give a f <laughs> give it a fair shot. It was shit. Yeah, I just remember you being like, it's super sexist and like ridiculous, and I was like, alright, well. Guess I won't be playing that garbage. <clears throat> um How the hell do I get up that fucking thing? Oh my god, you call me a hero? You really mean it? I'm out of grenades already? Fuck my life. Looks like I'm the badass shotgunner. Look how that guy died for like four minutes. Please, sir, stop throwing things at me. You're gonna poke somebody's eye out. Oh god. Um. You ain't gonna kill shit. Ease off the trigger talk. You ain't killing shit. Okay. Well, I wanted to shoot that barrel to kill you, sir. How dare you? I'm a lady. Oh, it's a bruiser. It's a bruiser. They're not a bitch. Oh. Up. A brand new meat bicycle. I love the 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 random nonsense the psychos yell. I can hear my teeth. Fuck the final boss, but the ending of the Tiny Tina DLC was adorable. Don't remember the boss or the ending. I just remember loving it because Tiny Tina is the shit, and that whole fantastical stuff was really dope. Almost 4 a.m. for me off to bed. Enjoy the game in Eternal. The Division Two is boo boo. <laughs> Have a good one, Del Vault. Thanks for hanging. Hopefully you had a good time. Yo, what's up, Braski? How's it going, dude? Dropping that spicy Mac 91 emote, hell yeah. Oh. Oh. Sure. I mean, that's not what I was planning on doing, but I'll take it. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Eternal. Wow. Uh, wait, we're gonna go back to... Uh oh. Where'd he go? Here. How the fuck do I get up there, though? Am I dumb? Don't answer that. Oh, nice. Also, I feel like all those chests reload or like get refilled every time you relaunch the game. Is that correct? There was a very quick don't answer that. Listen. I'm very well aware of the answer for that one.
I really like the music. I don't remember it being like so bongo y. It's super dope. Uh, turn in. Okay. Uh, let's see. While I'm out here, uh, I gotta kill 10 rack and then go back to Shep Sanders. I gotta go to him for this, anyways. So, we might as well do that one. And these are hard. Okay, so we'll do this, then we'll turn everything in, then we'll check the bounty board. And... That should be the most time efficient, XP efficient way of doing this. And then hopefully... Hopefully, this new stuff on the bounty board... Is, where the fuck is my car, by the way? Is like, doable? Hopefully it's like level 13-ish, so we don't have to jump right to that 15 uh, cave mission where I'm just going to get massacred. Yeah, I feel like this is where that Mothra bitch is. This should be interesting. Yup. Fucking yikes. Also, I can't aim this thing up at all. This looks way too clean to be the 360 version. Did they release this on Xbox One? Are you serious? Are you fucking serious, bro? Yeah, uh, this came out today. It's like it's the Game of the Year edition. It's um. Are you are you trolling or? I guess I might as well kill them for the XP. It's easy XP. I just don't want Mama Bear to come out. But yeah, if you're not trolling, I could give I could give you the the scoop. No, I had no idea this was coming out. Really? Yeah, it came out today. They um last week when they announced Borderlands 3 and stuff, they announced this. They were like. Borderlands Game of the Year Edition Remastered is out next week and it's so it's 30 bucks all the DLC is included uh, has like 4k ultra HD HDR all the all the bells and whistles you can see they added the minimap from Borderlands 2 they improved the UI uh, stuff magnetizes to you more um, what else they apparently redid the final boss so that it's like actually interesting. A whole bunch of yeah, quality of life changes and all. It's, it's crazy. Or why am I going here? Or wait, because I don't want to go there yet. I want to turn in the other stuff here. So yeah, it's pretty crazy. And then if you have. Uh, if you remember the gold keys, if you own the other Borderlands games, you get like 75 gold keys. Also, they updated the 360 version and you could upload your character so that you could get it in the Xbox One version. Kind of like with the Handsome Collection. So like I, I imported my level 67 Lilith. Feels good, man. I am a uh, very happy... Very happy boy right now. Alright, so those are all in progress. Let's see what we want to do. Let's let's go in order of level. So this. Circle of Death. Meet and greet. Oh. You got what it takes to be a gladiator. Enter the arena and put your life on the line for the amusement of our spectators and gamblers. Direct all inquiries to Raid Zabin. Uh, we'll leave that aside because even though it says level 12, the last round is probably going to be way too hard for now. Let's do this guy. So yeah, it's a uh, it's listed as Borderlands Game of the Year edition. Yeah, you could even see like it obviously it looks cleaner. It looks more like Borderlands 2. I mean, this very very Borderlands 1. But uh I find this looks more 2ish. I don't know, it's just it's just cleaner. 
and it looks better and yeah it's just uh it's a, diff a separate achievement list right kind of like with the handsome collection how it was just completely different um it's the same achievements and some are popping retroactively i'm gonna do uh joe was saying that he was just fast traveling from area to area and it was popping different achievements So I'm gonna do that, like I only popped a few, but luckily they were like claptrap collectible bullshit and stuff, so I'm just glad I don't have to do that again. But uh, yeah man, it's just... It's awesome. By the time I logged out, I was at 21 achievements and 400 gamer score, that's insane. Yeah, I'm, def I'm definitely gonna have to do that, it's just... I, I, The biggest thing that's pissing me off right now is that I have to do Cromorax again. Because that means that I'm going to have to do two entire playthroughs with her. And then grind. I could try to load up my first Lilith and try to solo Cromorax on playthrough one. I don't think it'll be doable. But I'm going to try. Just out of curiosity. Because that's a mission that you could replay and replay and replay. But, uh... Not feeling good about it. If anything, it might give me the Cromorax achievement, but uh, not the like all side missions, I don't think. I'm trying to think if I had done Cromorax or not. I don't know. Gotta be pretty high level. And he fucking scales. Like, I think the level cap is 69. I was 67. And final was 69. And Cromorax was like 72. And giving us a hard time. If I'm not mistaken. I remember, like, we finally did it, and then we just hit a level where he scaled again, and then it was fucking impossible again. Yeah, but if you're 42, you didn't do it. Is, isn't it like Terramorphous, where the base game's cap was like 50, and he so he was 52? And the way it works is you basically need four people that are level 50. Because it's like a raid boss, basically. Dude, these guys are fucking me up now. Ow! How are there so many, dude? See that health? Give me that shit. Is it just me or like, do you never see them? Because they just look like everything else. I'm just trying to think, was that the only raid boss in this game? And pre-sequel was... I'm trying to think like, who, what shitty bosses I'm going to have to do again in pre-sequel. Was the Hyperion robot dude pre-sequel or two? I think it was pre-sequel, right? And Master Mr. G or whatever. Hyperius was two? Okay, phew. I don't want to do that again. G was also two? Oh my god. So who was in pre-sequel? Wasn't there like a, a bug thing? It was like a... a, 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 a what are they called? Fuck, it was, um, V something. V Varkid? Wasn't there some kind of Varkid dude? I don't know that pre sequel had any? No? Were there not? I hope not. I just picked up a, a grenade mod, by the way. Where the fuck are- oh. I remember the final boss was pretty tricky. I don't remember if I had to do it twice. Or could it- Or were you able to just do it on hard mode or something? I- fuck, I don't remember. No, no, that doesn't make sense. I don't know. I don't remember. It's been a while, like I said. God, these guys just don't give a fuck.
Yeah, that doesn't do as much damage as I'd like. I keep wanting it to be like, um... Like, what's her face in, in Vermintide 2? Why am I drawing a blank when she's my main since Vermintide 1? The fuck? Uh... Carillion. Jesus Christ. The light. Yeah, Shade. That's it. The Shade class for Carillion to, uh, in 2. When you have everything perked out, you could go invisible and just melee them from behind and like just one shot pretty much everything. It's pretty gross. God, I need health so bad. Never mind. How am I full again? Although, like, no damage and very low monetary value. Fuck it. Um, let's see. We'll go back into that. Well, there's more dudes. Guess I might as well get some XP. Good fight. Uh, yeah, same thing. It's not very good. Hmm. Huh. 150 and 30. It takes a little bit, very slow health regeneration. Oh. Then I guess I want to do that one. Okay, um... In that case, I guess I should just drop... my shield. It's not very... valuable. Although... Yeah, okay, go away. Oh, this is, let's see, compare with the one I have equipped. This is, uh, bouncing Betty grenades. Pop up into the air before exploding. We'll equip that for now. And what is this guy? Rubberized grenades bounce off all surfaces and explode when they touch an enemy. In that case, I kind of want that, honestly. Same damage. And all that. Why not? That's worth 426? Might as well grab that and get more money. Okay. Um... Man, I don't know if it's my allergies have started or if I've just been fighting a cold for a couple of weeks, but my throat has just been so fucked lately, man. I ended up taking last night off just because I was like, well, I don't want to start anything new with Borderlands tomorrow. And my throat feels like I swallowed a razor blade. I guess I'll just rest my voice. But it's still so fucked, man. But I think it's just allergies started. And then I haven't started taking my meds yet, so... I think it's just that. Hopefully. Man, I'm hoping that pre-sequel didn't have... Uh, Bosses like that because I really don't remember And th those were always a pain in the ass I found Because they obviously required a lot of leveling you needed a team I don't even remember if I had to do a second playthrough of pre-sequel now that I think of it I think I just like grinded that boss after the first playthrough because it also gave you a lot of Moonstone. And then I just did the DLCs in order. I don't remember what- Did I just get 2100 from him? The fuck? Oh, wasn't it- The, the pieces don't have specific- 
Ooh. They don't have specific um, waypoints. It's just like you have to go somewhere in the area. So this is a lot more damage than what I'm rocking. I think we might finally get rid of that. <laughs> huh. Okay, well this guy... Ooh, times 9? Hold up, wait a minute. Compared to 20? Oh no, 20 times 9. Okay, so that can go. And then we'll pick up this guy. And we'll swap that for now and we'll see how it goes. I feel like I remember this specific SMG being brutal. I think if you have like the times 2, it's just like unbelievable. But I don't remember. That's another part. Um. Oh, I like that. Fuck, I don't remember where these pieces are. Oh, I just need one more? Okay. Well, that's good at least. And at least they have like a green... A green beam over them. Maybe over there. Or, can I get on top of here? Oh, yeah, there it is. Perfect. Perfect. We did it, gamers. Oh, I see a chesticle. So that one we could turn in. In which case, let's look for something else. So I have level... Yeah, that one we're gonna wait. Alright, so we'll do this. Download five log entries from data recorders in the Arid Badlands. That's Patricia Tannis. I remember you. Alright, let's do it, man. Also, I noticed before when I turned, I had a shadow there. No, it wasn't there before. But I guess it's because my screen is creased, so... I'm just gonna have to fix that next time. So, okay. That's what I thought. Actually, there's a vending machine right there. I should sell my stuff and just clear my inventory. I believe this game, like the other ones, uh, lets you upgrade your capacity for your backpack. I don't remember, but I feel like that's the thing. Can you go in these tubes? Oh, that's cool. I'm all about it, baby. Hmm. Nah. You're garbage. You're garbage, dude. You're just garbage. Wait. Am I rocking the wrong fucking gun? Yeah, I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. I'll keep that just in case. We'll sell that one. 62. Actually, that was lower than what I had. When the hell did I get that? Hello? Level 95 in Apex? Jesus Christ. So that one does a lot more damage. Accuracy is about half, but... Uh, recoil reduction, fire rate projectile... Okay, yeah, no, I gotta equip this guy. Alright, well, I'm gonna sell the bonus weapons, chat. The ones that we got at the start of the game are gone. F. Alright, in that case, I'm also going to sell that. Wait, my equipped shield is what, 127.21? No. 127.21. I'd rather have that one then. Oops. 
All right, backpack is empty. Let's roll. Downloaded for honor now, just to try a story since it was PS Plus. Maybe I won't delete it after one hour, like the Surge. Yeah, I saw you said you didn't like the Surge. Then again, you don't like anything. But for honor is with PS now? Hmm. I never even bothered with that game. I watched some streams and some Let's Plays and I was like... No! Just seemed very slow and boring. Alright, not a fan of the accuracy. Or lack thereof, but this thing seems to do a good chunk of damage. I mean, compared to before at least. Holy shit. The surge is lifeless as fuck though, and the area is straight garbage to navigate compared to souls? Really? That's annoying. I just realized I didn't grab a vehicle when I could've. I'm an idiot. <laughs> My god, he just dis disappeared. Man, it's it's so fun to just replay Borderlands. Oh wow, look at the difference. The bruisers were taking so much damage like two seconds ago. Oh my god. Hello. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, that's what these things are. Should have got this and waited on Days Gone pre-order. Yep. Superiors to find evidence of abandoned alien technology similar to that found by our competitor. Yeah, reach two Atlas next month. I can't wait. Ruins on Prometheus. Technology that many believe made them the superpower they are now. This kind of find seems astronomically improbable on a rock like this. But my benefactors believe in it enough to waste my considerable talents. I've only been here for three hours, and I already believe this planet will be the death of me. Scientists do not chase myths and legends. Day 43 on Pandora. At least I believe it to be the 43rd day. Oh, I could go get a vehicle. The moonlight cycles are difficult to get used to. Achievement. The planet rotation day is over 90 hours long. The people that inhabit this salted dust ball are as ignorant as I've seen in this galaxy. When I attach scientific inquiry to something like the vault, I'm greeted with silly nursery rhymes and slack jaw uh, about cool. a man who knew a man who knew a man. They drift off into a stupor where I half imagine they're drunk or brain damaged and are unaware of my continued presence. Oh, I actually hit it? Okay. I believed in hell I would contemplate how it compared uh, to Pandora. Here we go. Ironically, such a belief would align me with these Neanderthals. <laughs> Oh, Tannis, you're so ridiculous. Good driving, Shiz. Top notch as always. Nice. Nice, dude. Uh, let's go down here. That's awesome, Joe. At least you'll have uh, you'll have it ready for you when you get back, or you'll have it ready for the next day, I should say. I guess I should have stayed in the car. Whatever. Insanity. Just destruction, dude. I love it. Hell yeah. I forgot that I have rubber grenades now. Hello. Fuck is everybody? Oh, sub dudes. It's weird. My like mini map is just loaded, and I don't feel like there's that many enemies at all. Burning psycho. Please don't. Well, that didn't work. Idiot. Idiots. Fucking 
bruiser. Hell yeah, 420? Yo, blaze it, bruv. I'm out of ammo. Fuck, I'm out of uh, uh, SMG ammo. That is not ideal. Hey, we got health. Sweet! Oh yeah, I forgot that these guys like all fight each other. Sweet. Alright. Oh, I got SMG bullets. Sweet. Alright, I see. Where are you? Is he on the roof? Is it on fire? Oh, shit. Uh, am I just... Did I just trap myself? No, okay. Yeah, he's definitely up there. Uh... Can I? Okay. Fuck you. Huh. What is this? Ooh. Ooh. You're garbage, but ooh. You found a shock weapon. These can penetrate most sheep. This is the 76. Sorry, buddy. I was well, shut your mouth. I was a recurring nightmare. We spent uh, more than 36 hours earlier today. I've been in here before. Okay, open the door. Cool. Yo, what's up, buds? How's it going, man? Been a while. How you been? Half of my staff was eaten alive or killed by skags. I survived by hiding under a colleague of mine who was being devoured on top of me. His name was Carl. Being devoured on top of me? Emotions Jesus. Are dead and Hot. For none of them. Point of fact, the only emotion I felt was that of joy. I felt joy because his chair was always more comfortable. Than <laughs> I, took his I love the humor in these games. I noticed the emissive glow on the rock. This game is just Mad Max, uh, I guess. World War Z isn't coming. Isn't World War Z coming out? The game, yeah. I don't remember the release date, but actually looks pretty neat. Also, I left my car behind because I'm an idiot. I don't know where I left it, so we're just going to pretend like I don't have a car. At least the trek's not that bad anyways. No laptop? Oof. Oof. Is that... S I don't know if that star means that it's a person of interest? Or... Oh, I don't know. Oh no, the star is up here. What the hell is the star? Is that... Oh, that's like to go into another location. That makes sense. Alright, let's go and get this journal. And then we'll go get a vehicle. Boom. I sat in the shower in tears for just under an hour. This is interesting, considering we haven't had water for days. I equate my ever-decreasing sanity with that of the population of my dig site. With the investigation of the symbols and glowing patterns at the site, we finally unearthed arguably certifiable proof of the existence of alien life having been here on Pandora. But this celebration was lonely, as I only have two colleagues left. And I'm not too fond of the fat girl, Shimei. I've been told that scientific discovery requires sacrifice, but I never understood what they meant until now. <laughs> Man, she's funny. She's like fucked in the head, but... Uh. Thank you for all that x pizzles, my friends. I was just about to say... Got a little blood on the tires. Kill 25 vehicles. Okay. Uh, I was just going to say, if there isn't an achievement for doing all the challenges, it's definitely worth it as far as XP goes. Huh. Fat shaming. Right here is the last 
Journal. Oh my god. What the fuck? Um... Oh shit, 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 let me kill them! Let me kill them! Damn it. Damn it. Well, that's the first death. So I didn't realize till too long that it was Rax. How did I get one shot? I guess they hit the explosive, uh... The explosive barrel or something? Yo, I just rude kill a flying enemy. What up? Dude, look at this guy. Look at this fucking beast over here. Look at this guy. Animal. Animal, dude. That's actually, like, fucking brutal. Totally brutal, dude. F. F for the skills. What do you fucking stop? Alright. Bitch. Bitch boy. <laughs> wow. I like that you can just splatter anything. Boosh. Not so tough now, dude. Huh. Beautiful. Shout out to GameStop not having enough of this in stock of people complaining. Yeah, they really didn't have much. Then again, I guess they didn't expect it to sell like hotcakes, which I didn't expect either. I'm sure it'll be pretty decent because of the amount of content and just it's cheap. Like the fact that it has all the DLC included and stuff and it's like 30 bucks. I hesitated because she was the last one alive that wasn't me. Uh, but yeah, and there weren't even any pre-orders for like digital. Dying, I tried to enjoy the interaction, which I imagined to be a conversation, as I knew it was the last I would have for a while. Oh well, it is what it is, man. Smothering her so that I could continue my research, I could tell that she regretted the decision. I'm sure they'll. Uh, Skaggs has been waiting for this. I'm sure, they'll press more. They will not go hungry tonight. Just sucks for people that obviously were like. Looking forward to getting it, uh, and couldn't, right? I'm getting like barely any XP from these guys, but considering how easy they are to kill, I might as well. Okay, I guess I'm going back to the Firestorm board. Alright. Dude, I'm already level 13. God damn. Craziness. What an unstoppable warrior. And people were crying that Owl Boy Collector's Edition had more copies made. That is kind of ridiculous. That's very ridiculous. What the fuck? Is there UK physical? As far as I know, it's only US and Canada. It's just GameStop and EB Games. Don't forget to check out Marcus's store. Cool. Everything else is in progress. Okay, so that's that bullshit. That's tough, tough, tough. I guess I have no choice but to do this. I think you got it. what it takes to be a gladiator. Enter the arena, put your life on the line for the amusement of our spectators and gamblers direct. All of Okay. Chat, I'm gonna get murdered here. I am gonna get fucking smoked. Hopefully... I'm close to level 14, so hopefully during it, I'll level up and it'll give me a full heal and stuff. Hmm. Not like this game is any good. No, it's great. 
I'd go as far as saying it's amazing. Yeah, this is definitely what I thought it was. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's just uh, stock up on... Right up. Fucking anything. Oh, I'm gonna get destroyed, dude. Whoa, 66. 321. Well, it is a rocket launcher. 3,700, and I have 31,000. I guess I should do SMG. That costs six grand? Ow. Ow. I keep doing that. I don't know why. That hurt. Uh, we're going to swap the rocket, um, the sniper rifle with the rocket launcher for here. That's the shotgun and that's the rocket launcher. Okay. Hey, man. God, I'm gonna get destroyed. 20 shambling rounds kill me? Oof. Yeah. Don't miss that. Chat, I'm gonna get fucking obliterated. I hope you know. I'm gonna leave that health there. Dude, it's already hard. I think it goes to five waves, or is it three? Oh, I'm level 14 at least. Uh, boom. Good thing I put, uh... Resistance to elements. And we'll keep that. We'll keep the rockets for when there's uh, inevitably a, a really big. You know what? Never mind. I changed, changed my mind immediately. Okay. Good, good shit. Good shit. Um, are you fucking serious already? Level, level 13, by the way. Okay. Dude, it's already hard. The title of Shiz's <laughs> gay sex tape. Wow. Well. Cool mission, bro. Um, we'll come back. That's exactly what I thought would happen. Those missions always make no sense. They're horribly scaled. How was that a level, like, 12 mission? Oh, now it's up to level 15. Seems like the enemies hit a whole lot harder now. It's, um... It's because, like, wave 1 is 12, and then it jumps to 15. So now it's too high. Because it's all... It's all also, like, alpha skags. But it's fine. We did... We did round 1. We'll just come back when we're high enough level for the rest. And then when I get the level, the round three thing, I'm sure it's going to go up to like 17, 18. We'll have to come back again and whatever. Let's get my shit pushed in by enemies that were five plus levels below me. Yeah. Or like I said, when I played, uh, when I threw on the 360 version on Monday with Chris, it was so weird. He was 62, I was 67. And cars that were level 37 were one-shotting us. I was like, what is this scaling, dude? made no sense to me how many like missions have we done here um is this like the ones that are done i've done about like five percent of this game
What did uh, Cully help you with yesterday, buds? Sweet. That's not it's not much XP, but you know what? I'll take it. Oh, these are in the water too? Does that nah it doesn't really do a thing in this game? That's fine. Let me guess it was farmed together. I saw that game just got another update. I saw also that Dragon Ball Fighters got an update yesterday that was like four or five gigs. See how the music went all serious too? That was a lot of XP! I'm stuck. For some reason you can't jump like that. I'm gonna help someone and farm together for five days now. I think I might be free. That's awesome. Congratulations. It's pretty cool, man. Uh, I'm going up there. Okay, then. That's a lot of dudes. Hey, man. What's up? <laughs> well, yeah. I'm definitely doing a hell of a lot more damage. And they're giving a hell of a lot more XP. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. This is what we need. This is definitely what we need right now. I should have kept my old grenades. These these bouncy grenades are actually kind of shit. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely nowhere near as good as I was hoping for. Damn it. What the hell happened? Hello? Is this the gun? What the? Is it just me or did it just go like all purpley? I guess it just turned to night. It just very suddenly. That was weird. Borderlands copied Apex. Uh, I believe Boomshot is is Boda, is Boda yet? He's always changing his account, like back and forth between a couple of names. That I don't know why. Where am I going? I don't remember what this mine is. Speaking of mine, Cully, had you seen that like a week or two ago Minecraft got one new achievement in every version? And obviously very, very easy within a with an achievement world. I'm just gonna kill oh th that was still there, huh? Yeah, I think like I said, uh I feel like everything stays in place while you've got the game open. And then when you like Quit it and reload it. Um, I feel like it resets the chests and all that stuff. I, I could be wrong about that though, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. But it's cool that it, it kept the guns that I left on the ground from last time. I figured that they would like despawn once I left the area or something. That's really cool. Boda just followed me on Twitter. He's Boda Yeet. Yeah, he uh, he changed it. So funny. I 
Oh, we got Sludge's safe house. All right. Uh, let me just see if there's any loot on top. Oh, good thing I checked, huh? Oh man, chat, this game is so fun. Let's see what we've got. Feels so good to be back in the Borderlands. All right, cool. All that's good. Boom. Let's just uh, just hop down and check this out. Um, man, I really hope that those achievements retroactively pop. Uh. With my other character. Speaking of achievements, I got a whopping five gamer score. Unstoppable animal. This is actually gonna be really hard. I remember this area. Got, you definitely got some toughies, as you can see. Some dudes that just don't care about your damage whatsoever. Oh yeah, wasn't there... Is that not like a claptrap mission or something? What the fuck? Oh, wow. Uh, I am actually very scared, sir. Thanks for asking. Yeah, I could be wrong, but I feel like that's a, a little claptrap over there or something. I'm gonna leave all the shit on the ground. We'll worry about it, uh... After. Yeah, I gotta go around for that one. I remember that. Yeah, we'll worry about all that loot after we clear the place. If we do clear the place. Give me that health. Oh shit, there he is. Hey man, what's up? Yeah, isn't it like a busted claptrap? There it is. Okay. What the hell is this? You gain 60 health over 10 seconds can be carried in your storage desk. Deck. Uh, I guess let me just... I'll like drop that. Pick this up. Use it. Was that ever a thing? I didn't I didn't know that that was a a thing in this game. <laughs> you could hear the claptrap crying and shit. Oh my god. That was not ideal. Uh-oh. Oh, I have no grenades. I wanted to be cheeky and throw it through the crack. God damn. That uh, backfired pretty, pretty hard. Okay. I feel like there's some really hard dudes at the end of this area. And that being said. Really wish I had health and grenades. I want that health. Oh, I'm gonna die. Why? Why you gotta fuck me like that game? Uh, oh, there he is. Hey, man, what's up? 
Uh, we'll worry about that in a second, right now. Is that what we're doing? No. That's what we're doing. Look at all this stuff. My turbo. Oh, oh. 20 times 11, or 50 times 12. Well, hmm. Hmm. What a tough, what a tough choice that is. Well, let's try this shit, man. Yeah, this is a beast. This is definitely a beast. I that doesn't sound good. <laughs> uh oh. There they are. What's up, boys? Okay. Whew. I actually like this mission a lot. For now. I won't like it as much when, um... When I'm getting rinsed in the final area. But for now it's fun. If I remember correctly, it's like there's either a big room... Yeah. It's either a big room with like a million dudes. Or it's just a couple of really strong guys that just rick, rip you apart. My. 22? Why would I want that? That's garbage. Although, how much is it worth? 1200. Do we have any garbo? 191. And it's not very good damage wise. Cool. Um. Yeah, it doesn't. Bode well for me that there's just arrows pointing everywhere. Ammo like crazy. Usually that's not a good sign. That's like video game lingo for you're about to get shit on, fam. Just to see if there's anything this way. I'll go around where I'm supposed to go. God, I hate their noises. They're so creepy. Oh, how did I... Oh, okay. Sweet. God, this music, though. I'm, like, so on edge. Obviously, anybody that's played Borderlands knows, but, uh... I... Did I just get one-shotted? If you didn't know, uh, every time you die, it gets more and more expensive because it's a certain percentage of your money. And then obviously it'll respawn me at like a respawn point. I'll have to run all the way back or whatever. So I'd rather not, uh, rather not die. This is, uh, this is the room I remember. Look at his health, just not moving. Level 14 mission, by the way. Dude, I'm so fucking dead. It went through him. Also, these little fuckers... Can I please have some health? You fucking prick, you fucking prick, there you go.
That was close. Oh, baby. If I if I wasn't uh if he wasn't one shot, I would have been bone there. 197 times 3 rocket launcher. All right, well, let's uh let's toss the one that we're using then. That's beast. Or how much is that worth? 534. You know what? It's all good, baby, baby. Fuck you, bitch. What is this though? It's a purple. <laughs> Boy, it'd be cool if I could actually look at the fucking thing. It is. Ooh, it's very nice. I want it. Uh, is this worth a lot? 424? Nah. Alright, we ro rocking that perp, baby. We rocking that perp. Uh... Oh, yeah. Also, I just looked at the time. I'll finish this mission. And... You should be able to get into the mine now. There's nothing between you and... And then we'll... Call it a night there. I don't remember if, if I get attacked again. Also, at least we spoke to the claptrap. Um, here, find the repair kit and repair this claptrap. You discovered a defunct claptrap here. It looks like the bandits were pretty rough on him. Maybe, perhaps there's a repair kit nearby. Let's see if it's. Oh, it's like in the area. Okay, we'll do this. Then I'll go turn in. And um. We'll call it a night there. I just hope that nobody spawned. Also, I feel like I should loot this place. Uh, where that? Wait, where did I come in from? Here. Okay. Yeah, I feel like I should loot this place. All right. You know what? We'll we'll just see. Like on the way out, we'll see the the weapons and shit. See if there's anything good. Also, we could see if there's any ammo. I feel like we come back to this area a couple times throughout the game. But don't quote me on that. Yeah, I didn't even use grenades. You know what? All things considered, that fight went really well. That roared ragey bitch. Well, yeah, like I said, I hope you guys have been enjoying this playthrough so far because I'm... Jesus Christ. I'm loving this, man. There's something about these Borderlands games that just, like... It's just my jam. My God. Okay, this gun is dope. That one, not so much. We're gonna kill shit, son. Noink. Eh. Whatever. I feel like I had guns and stuff everywhere. Oh. Contact grenades explode after touching an enemy. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. Plus it does tw 35 damage instead of... Uh, oh, 722? 35 damage instead of 22? Hell yeah. Uh, do I have anything like dirt cheap that's... Not gonna get used anymore. I guess that, right? That's what 275, 126. Uh, lol. I think I've already gotten to the point where I gotta just stop using white weapons. Just like common weapons are uh, are absolutely useless now. 
Isn't he like right down below? Yeah, but I gotta run all the way around, don't I? <laughs> oh, claptrap. I'm sorry, little buddy. I'll fix you right quick. Okay, there's just... Hey, man. Thanks for the cranberry juice. What a guy. Four eighty one, eh. Here man. Oh wait, did that give me That just gave me an upgrade, right? Yeah, increase your backpacks here there yeah. Okay. I knew there was something that, like that was an important mission for the completion. Because um if you want the achievement for all the upgrades, you have to do that. That's what it was. Also, did he not just open a door? A 271, go away. Take this. What did you just open, buddy? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Clap trap. Ooh. It's a pipe pool. 36 times 11. Actually, it's not even... Everything about it is worse, but it's worth three grand. So in that case, what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop something of little value and we're gonna take that obviously. Group five. This thing sucks balls. Yoink. Cool. You're saying they're worthless because they're white racist. I knew you were gonna say that too. Uh sniper rifle, that was 72. This is 97. But this one has the element, I believe. Fire. We'll do the 97. I'm going to keep this and I'm going to sell everything else. Creates a large fire nova when depleted. That's kind of... That's kind of kind of useful. I think I'd rather the lower capacity and it do that. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, so yeah, now we just gotta turn in. Fuck am I going? Uh, actually, how many missions do I have to turn in? Just one, right? Okay. Yeah, we'll turn this in, like I said. Save and quit there. And, um... That'll be it for tonight's stream. Tomorrow, obviously, more Borderlands. Friday, we'll most likely check out Enter the Gungeon. On day one. Saturday... On Saturday, I might do something special. Mortarlands? Dude, nice. Dude. $89? 89 whole smackaroos? Um... So, on April Fool's Day... The Rivals of Ether devs put out a dating sim called Lovers of Ether. But it actually is like a legit game and it's free to play. And obviously it's like just ridiculous. You know, it's meant to be a joke. Um, so I got to test because even though obviously there's not much going on visually, it's just my graphics card is so bad that it, my PC just doesn't like running anything that's a game. So, yeah, on Saturday morning, it looks good. I know, right? I, I don't know how long it is. I, like, looked on YouTube and I saw there was one video that was, like, an hour and 40 minutes. I don't know if that's, like, a full playthrough or what. I saw that there's, like, 15 Steam achievements. It's like you gotta basically finish the game with every character, it sounds like. Um. Anyways, I figured... 
Friday I want to check out the Enter the Gungeon update, but uh, achievements are like Steam achievements. But they were saying it's at like, I think they said it's at 32,000 downloads, and at 100,000 they'll consider bringing it to other platforms. So here's the hope when it comes to Xbox and it's an easy completion. If it's a, uh, if it's fun. It's uh, like I said, the achievements are all just like getting getting the characters to prom. So maybe it's like specific choices, and maybe it's a little, a little precise. But people already have the Steam completion. It came out two days ago. Anyways, point being, Saturday morning when I have time, I'm gonna test it, see if it runs smooth. If it does, um, we'll do Borderlands or Gungeon during. The first like five six hours, and then we'll we'll end with uh, an hour or two of that. BRP making sixty five k Steam accounts, dude. Do it. Do it. Something something dark side. But um, yeah, I figured that could be uh could be pretty funny. So why not? Yo, one hundred twenty eight XP. Hello. Hello? Nope. Don't like this thing reloads after two shots, but with the amount of damage it does. Thank you. Yeah, so the alphas. If I remember correctly, the reason they're so annoying is because they're they're armored. You have to wait till they open their mouth, and then you can really rinse them. But um, e easier said than done. Scunchin completion isn't getting done before updates so slow. Yup. But again, that's super easy. I'm sure the update's gonna be time consuming and rough anyway, so I'm sure you're gonna have plenty of time to. You're gonna have plenty of time to to grind that stuff while you're working on the other shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, but it would be literally all my money? Yeah, no. I'm good. I have 23 grand and that was 22 grand. Fuck. More players equals tougher enemies. Tougher enemies equals better loot. It's true. They actually do a really good job of scaling uh, difficulty in Borderlands. Uh, do they have any achievements for resing friends? Like Borderlands 2, I think yeah, there's an achievement for like resing f somebody on your friends list like five times. I think you have to also resurrect a player with with oxygen in Borderlands the pre-sequel. Again, it's so early in the game, I don't need to worry about achievements yet. At all. As far as I know, there's no missables. I have to double check. Let me just... Splatter these dudes for some easy XP. Not much, but some. I guess I'm turning it into the dude at the end there? Oh no, actually, I think I'm going back to Firestone. Am I? Fuck, where am I going? I... okay. Anyways, like I said, I, either way, after the stream, I'm uh, while I'm making the thumbnails for the YouTube series, I'll um... I'll just be fast traveling. Oh. Oh, okay. Piss off. Lol. I guess I'll fast travel. Oh, one second. Oh. Oh. In that case, let's go pick those up first because I'm. Oh. Fuck. Uh, the Arid Badlands. This is. Oh, wait, is it this? Unknown, how mysterious. Oh, here, okay. 
But hit the fan. Mission available and... Okay. Place waypoint. Hell yeah. I totally forgot that you could do like custom waypoints and stuff. Actually, I guess you couldn't in... You couldn't in Borderlands 1. Could you? That's a Borderlands 2 thing, right? In pre-sequel? Wow, it was literally... Wait, what? Oh, no, that's the... The story mission. I'm an idiot. Oh, that's the thing, it just doesn't... Give you a diamond. That's... okay. F. I might as well... I... I don't like leaving shit like this, just like... Waiting for the next day. I'd rather have this just picked up and that way tomorrow we could just start with the missions instead of picking the missions up, if that makes sense. Hey, dude. What hit the fan? I don't know. Your mama. <laughs> uh, and then this is the Firestone Bounty Board, I believe. Whoops. Uh, I don't remember how... To switch? Maybe it's just A or something? I don't know, whatever. I believe Firestone is just- oh my god, just down here, right? I just take the shortcut. And just go literally down the street. Yeah, okay, that's- that's what that is. Why did I do that, idiot? Um... I'm trying to think, like... Theoretically, picking this up will make it save. Or no, if you quit to the main menu, it forces a save anyways, right? Okay. Yeah, we'll just do that. Uh, exit. Exit. It, says, it said all progress will be saved, right? And now... Let's just double check... That it lets me choose between my two Liliths. So, select character. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. So I'll leave it on the main menu, seeming as I'm gonna do that stuff off camera, but for now let me kill the local recording.